Everybody, welcome back to my channel today. It is Monday the 14th of June and I am vlogging because I have finished the college for the day. I went in at nine o'clock and I did some uploading on this kind of website. It's basically like upload like all our room work and the consultation forms and stuff and then I went to Spoons after that and then I left my friends to go home because yeah, they were actually getting their like ears pierced and stuff but obviously I am too much of a wuss to get my ears pierced again. I've only got these ones pierced and I've had these pierced ever since I was around like 9 or 10 years old but you know I do have tiny ears and I feel as if like if I had another piercing then my ears would be yeah, my ears will probably get a bit too overcrowded, so I'd rather just like leave them how they are, you know? Sorry, phone cut off because it's got his first time in me. I should really invest in like a little vlogging camera actually, but yeah, it's just money that I don't need to spend right now. But anyway, yeah, and when I mean I've just got home, I literally dumped my college bag. Please, please excuse all the mess on this bed. I did not. I made my bed this morning because I was too lazy to make my bed. But yeah, I dumped my bag, I literally brushed my hair. It became my hair was so tight and then I started vlogging because, you know, you need to be dedicated when you're doing YouTube because YouTube is, is quite hard work. But yeah, but I'll be seeing Scott later on. He'll be coming to the house. He usually comes to ours on a Monday because that is the day where he doesn't really have as many orders on as like the weekend and stuff. And Monday is kind of more of his kind of chill day. So yeah, the fun times. My face is looking a bit awry now because I have had my makeup on since around 8 o'clock this morning and it is almost 2 o'clock I think. Is it? Yeah, almost 2 o'clock. I use the Too Faced Morning Spray Foundation again. I really like it. It's perfect match on my skin. Also please excuse the patchy tan. It literally, it will not come off my arms. So just excuse the patchy tan. It's so bad. But we just need to ignore that right now. You know, outfit of the day top. He's from Primark, I think it was only around £6, but it's really cute and it's perfect to wear for college because um, it's not cropped and it covers your shoulders. Oh yeah, and we don't really have to wear uniform anymore for college because you've, you've pretty much finished all the practical work. And then I'm wearing my black River Island pants because they are an essential clothing item in my wardrobe to wear with this kind of clothing and crop tops and stuff. But yeah, um, and also I was meant to be going for like a meal, like a few drinks with my friend tomorrow. I was filming this, which is cancelled. So I'm really gutted about that actually, because the place where I booked for us to go, it was like this really like it's it's only recently just opened since the lockdown, and it's called the Print Yard in Carlisle. In case you ever want to go, it's meant to be really nice. They've got this outside area and like it's really colourful and like the food and drinks are meant to be nice um but yeah i'm not going there anymore so i'm kind of sad about it but i'm sure i will be able to go another time because it's always there are plenty more times to go so yeah but i always feel really weird coming home early from college because i feel like they're really disorientated i don't know what to do but i do actually have a lash exam tomorrow so I will have to do like a bit of revision for that. <laughs> the other joy is to still be a college student. But yeah, I'm hoping I could be finished college by next week. Like, yeah, that'll be my college days over. I think I've been saying that in a lot of my vlogs for a while, but it's like it's starting to get a bit real now, like finishing college and everyone's kind of like, you know, going separate ways and stuff. Oh yeah, and we actually brought in a present for our tutor today and she cried and like, it set me off a little bit and I did cry a little bit. Like, I did have, like, a couple of tears, but that was it, you know. <laughs> but, yeah, it was quite emotional, actually. And, like, she opened up quite a bit, so we were all a bit, like, emotional. But it's fine. It's fine, you know. Anyway, I don't know what I'm going to do because I literally feel so lost. I was thinking of filming a YouTube video, but do you know when you don't really have any clue of what to film? I do have a free afternoon tomorrow because... I will be going into college at half one for the exam and then going home so i could just put some makeup on something but i'm thinking of filming like a makeup tutorial because people like to see them um and 
I need to get one uploaded really well I need to get one filmed uploaded so it leaves me with your ideas because I I'm always stuck these days because three because filming three videos a week is quite a lot especially when I'm pretty much working almost full time at my other job and also at college like it yeah I just need to get uh the cracking and film some videos so let me know what you want to see but yeah I think I'm going to do some revision because I want to pass my exam because it is like the eyelash extension one but I want to make it issue that I pass it otherwise yeah that will not be good time to clean my room before Scott comes because it is looking a bit of a tip especially over there and on my bed and stuff on the floor but I think firstly I'm gonna attempt to clear all this up and then use a happy loss of spray and clean it over one of my clean sponges has been chipping my oh, what's this called makeup desk as you can see it's been chipping it where's the other chip at there so yeah it's not good but it's fine we're all of it also when my room is cleaned i will be switching i will be plugging this febreze like air thing in because oh my god these you make your room smell unreal and you fill your room with like a lovely smell of like your berries and stuff i do have like a christmasy scent in here but it smells unbelievable so yeah but anyway i'm gonna get on the roll of this before scott comes he hasn't set off yet but i, I like to be organized i haven't been revising yet because i decided to have a chocolate bar <laughs> priorities you know but he'll be doing a bit of editing soon and also there's some revising i might get the scott to actually quiz me on some stuff because it would be helpful because you know but the maturity did say that the exam should be easy so i'm i feel a bit more happy about that to be honest but you know yeah i'm gonna make my room it look presentable because i'm quite embarrassed right now to be honest um but yeah excited also these eyelashes actually annoying me so much right now but i'm leaving them on because eyelashes are complete the makeup look you know the beauty is pain as a lot of us may know by now but speaking of beauty i did actually wax my eyebrows and upper lip last night my eyebrows are in really good shape and my upper lip is so smooth like i literally have not a single strand of hair on there because i literally was waxing it for ages but yeah, I'm now, you know, the wax pot is literally empty as anything, like it's so bad. I'll have to buy some more wax because it's literally at the very bottom. But it's fine. It's alright. So yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna get a move on with this. This is all the makeup I've been using today. This beautiful Too Faced bronzer, which is the natural lust one. It, it's been discontinued for like a little while now, but it's beautiful and the packaging is just stunning. My doll beauty highlighter, the packaging is coming off that. <laughs> Look, all the gold is true coming off it and so sad, but oh my god. If you want to have like a good affordable highlighter, get this one. It's £15. They've got it in like a diamond, which I've got here, and also the the darker one. I use this with cream contour. This is like my everyday kind of foundation when I don't have fake tan on in the shade snow. It is and oil free your foundation which is perfect for oily skin girls like myself the revolution concealer in c2 i use this priming spray to wet my sponge because it actually works so well i mean and then i use a real technique sponge i use my revolution powder which is hip pan yeah i'm all stocked up on this powder though so it's fine also my two Faced peachy primer because it's a really good primer the duo lash glue because i like my duo I've also got this, which is the Peaches and Cream Gloss in Honey, the best nude shade ever. I think they're only like six pounds. But Peaches and Cream makeup is actually so underrated, and their makeup brushes as well are actually beautiful. Like, oh my god, such good quality for what they are, really affordable. And the Morphe eyebrow, the Morphe eyebrow made in latte. I sometimes wear this Too Faced Melted Latex Gloss. It's like in between a lipstick and a gloss. It kind of feels really tacky on your lips, but it looks so nice on your lips. And the packaging again is beautiful. The Morphe Brow Gel, my, uh, what's it called, mascara, my eyeliner, 
Eyeliner from Maybelline. And then I also have my Human Lash Box, which is full of bits of eyelash glue, but you get the gist, it's just an eyelash box. And in the style in New York, and they sell these in Primark for £5, so they're actually beautiful eyelashes. Like, look at these eyelashes, guys. Beautiful. Oh, I love them. But yeah. Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, and also, I could not forget his beauty. It is the Morphe 35 XO Valentine's palette. Oh, it's beautiful. I love it. The, the shade I've been using a lot is just Friends because it's just like the best the simple eye look to be using on your eyes, you know? But yeah, but I, def I would definitely have to test out more of these colours because it's actually beautiful and the Morphe eye a Morphe eyeshadow palettes are so affordable and of really good quality, so thanks Morphe, love ya. And just like that, the dressing table is all nice and clean. It looks really shiny, but all I used was this Fabulosa Electrify in one spray, and oh my god, if you haven't tried this scent, it smells unreal. And it makes all these surfaces look nice and clean. I also cleaned this mirror as well, but yeah. It smells so good. I actually prefer the sprays in the aerosol because I feel I feel as if it cleans better and it also leaves a bit of a shine on your surfaces. So I highly recommend. And I think it's only around I think it's only around one forty nine. Everybody is in my kitchen. And oh, I smell that box. Wait. Wait. Oh my god. He's also made mm. there's some cookie pie for like his business and he's, he's selling it and he's brought so us a few bits. Cookie case filled yeah. with the bueno spread, <gasps> chocolate. Kinder, oh my yeah, god. Yeah, kinder pieces. Oh and god. also, did you roll the camera? Yeah. He's got me a bunch of peony roses, my favourite flowers. Ooh. They are absolutely stunning. Oh my god, where do you get them from? I'll tell you. Told you the graveyard. <laughs> no, you see, look, like that one's closed. They're, yeah. Because you're meant to get them closed for the yeah. last longer. But that one, since I fiddled around with them, look at that. It's like <gasps> opened up. Beautiful, though. I had no paper, so I had to just tie them in a bit of so like cute. a little string. So I'm happy. So Thank you very much for the little flowers. <laughs> I love them. I have a bit of cookie pie. I've also put <laughs> in the flowers. I've also put in the flowers in my little vase now. What size of that? Oh man, it's huge. Oh my god, the pink is my favourite colour. Is that on a kiak? On a cake or a kiak? On a kiak. A kiak. It's like half a bit because. Well, I've already had a bit. To Have you? Yeah. Oh no. What I would advise, what I'd yeah. advise to do is cut it down lengthways. Oh yeah. So you get like four, four like two portions at once. Like. Okay then. I'll cut it for you. Okay, thank you very much, chef. Cut it more flies. Is this not? Oh. What? Still got flies. Honestly, flies yeah, are the yeah. bane of our lives. You know that red knife that we've got at home? Yeah. Do you have anything like that? Well, yeah, that'll be all right. Yeah, it's a steak knife, isn't it? It's just a knife. Can I use, can I use a board? Are you going to clean your mess up? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. When I live with you, I'm going to keep you clean. That's what you said to me last Oh, I know, well... It's because I left a bit of cold water in the sink. <laughs> Cute. It looks so the good board. though. Yes, the board shall be in there, I think. Yes, there's a board for you. Your board? Which one? You just use. Is that, that's for fish. Is it? That's for red meat. I don't know. So you just need that one? Yeah, that's fine. Do you eat? Oh, sorry. You're just going to pets at home now because it's Dave's, it's Dave's second birthday tomorrow. Pets at Yam. <laughs> They're 15 in dog years. So we're going to get an antler for her from your mum. If that makes sense. I, I was on your I believe she now. messaged you as well. She doesn't trust me, does she? And, oh, no, she doesn't. Organised, Danny, you see. But yeah, I don't wearing any makeup because I took it off because it was just coming up her face. You're beautiful. It? God. You're right. Beautiful. Let's go to the shop. It's true. You can have a look at the fish and then you can buy some more tropical fish because. What, and put them in. Where would you put them? These babies have been, like, mating, so. It yeah, just means more babies to be honest in your tank. We've also I think they're toddlers now. Oh no. They're toddlers? No. no. Babies sound. I don't know which one sounds worse. Hey, look at the hamsters. Over Send that there. to your mum. Oh, there's two. Oh no, there's two. Oh, there's... the one at the back. Oh. Are they just young? Oh yeah. They're struggling to yeah. get out. No. Oh, look at it eating. I know they'll oh, be my eating. God, it's, it in it. it's just shoved it in it. Oh yeah, I know. Yeah, that's what hamsters do. Well, yeah, but there's some that's come up for food, but look at them. 
There's one down there moving about. Look, it's coming. Oh. This one. Oh my god, they're so cute. I want one. How does it nibble on that car? Look at that one. I don't get how it's nibbling on it. Oh my god. I want one. Oh, Sam. So cute. You've yeah, been in pets at home. We've got Stacey's birthday tomorrow. We bought her a few things. What have we bought her first? Yeah, this little cow. Oh, that is so cute. You have six pounds, this little dog six toy. Six pounds, that's terrible. And Daisy's yeah. having like a phantom pregnancy at the moment. And oh. she kind of, it looks like a cow at the minute. Oh, you. Because we think that if we give her this like... Where do cows go for dirt? There's so a cow shed. Oh. <laughs> and then we've got, what some else? We've got some peanut butter and banana. Yeah. These are safe for... Should we have a? Should we try? Oh uh, no, I'm all right, thanks. Uh, and then new seats. Yeah. So she can pay us back from her, from her, um, <laughs> from her off port account. <laughs> all right. Okay. Anyway, um, an antler. An antler. Yep. And what else? A filled bone with lamb and mint in it. I could Ooh. just eat that right now. Oh. Love lamb and mint. Well, I hate it. Do you? I love it. Yeah, but that cow is so cute. So she has a cow, a lamb, a deer, and a banana. A good little meal that will be, isn't it? Banana. Yeah. Oh, bless her. She's a little cutie. She deserves it, doesn't she? <laughs> Hashtag ad. Hashtag. Pets at home. Imagine if it was like actual advertisement. Oh my god. What are you doing? In them now, aren't we? Because. I need to get like like a few bits and you've you also dropped the bonnie off at the netball because she starts at six and finishes at seven so yeah so I, I need to get some boring stuff like a rice pouch and antibacterial cloves we wash and and butter beans and boring stuff like that so yeah are you excited let's go to b and mum's ringing oh Here's next morning and I forgot to end the vlog last night again because I am so forgetful at the moment and yeah, I literally forget to do everything but like I've woke up and had my breakfast Um, I did put a drying spot lotion on last night and I've taken it off with toner this morning hence why my face is probably a bit pink because yeah, I've used a bit of toner on my face and my skin is kind of breaking out again, which is brilliant because that is what I want right now, isn't it? Like, the spotty skin, you know? But anyway, I am, um, well, basically, I'm going to college for half the one because we have like a lash exam. So, like, I'm kind of getting ready. It's currently half nine, so I do have like a good few hours to get ready and stuff. Um, I don't know if I should put makeup on because I, I want to film like a, like a makeup kind of video, but I'm really stuck because I don't really want to leave the house with like spotty skin, so I don't know what to do. But anyway, I will be ending this vlog here, so I really hope that you guys have enjoyed this vlog. If you have, make sure to leave a thumbs up, comment down below and subscribe, and I'll see you all in my next video.